Brad Pitt wants a Jennifer Aniston style divorce from Angelina Jolie. Brad Pitt's pulling the same moves he did when he divorced Jennifer Aniston in his split from Angelina Jolie. We've got details on how history is repeating itself when it comes to the actor using a private judge to keep his dissolution details a secret. We were totally shocked January 9th when for the first time in their messy divorce saga, Brad Pitt, 53, and Angelina Jolie, 41, put up a united front, announcing they hired a private judge to oversee their case and have all of the details kept quiet. It turns out this isn't Brad's first time at the rodeo when it comes to doing this. Brad Pitt did the same thing with Jennifer Aniston in their divorce as they hired a private judge, Jill Robbins, to push things through more quickly and keep it all under wraps, divorce lawyer and legal expert Kelly Chong Rickard tells exclusively. When you think about it, despite all the attention surrounding his then new relationship with Angie, his 2005 divorce from Jen was very drama-free. This really is only a process that the super rich can afford. Private judges are very expensive ranging from $800 to $1,500 per hour and they are basically rented out by the parties to preside over the case, so, you do not have to wait in line like the normal public do, Kelly tells us. The former couple definitely has the bucks to afford this path. Both Brad and Angelina will sign a stipulation saying that they agree to use the private judge instead of the public judge assigned. They also have to agree to whatever decision the private judge makes and that it will be binding. The biggest advantage is that it will keep things totally private and out of the public spotlight, Kelly adds. After all the mudslinging that was going on before they made this decision, these two definitely doesn't need any more dirty laundry aired. It seemed to work in his first divorce, but then again Angelina Jolie is a very different person to Jennifer Aniston and there were also no kids involved either. Jill Robbins is very well respected, but it remains to be seen if Angelina and her team would go for her, given her previous involvement with Brad, Kelly tells us. I think that Angelina and her lawyer are going for a different tactic after Brad's reception at the Golden Globes and given that public opinion seems to be on his side. I believe Angelina knows that her behavior was malicious and that ultimately this wasn't really getting her anywhere or doing anyone any good either. Brad received such an outpouring of love during his surprise appearance at the awards show January 8, and that had to have given Angie a wake-up call to start playing nice. Do you think Brad and Angelina will be able to come to terms on custody of their kids?